Hey guys, Jared with Trident Fly Fishing, and today we're going to be tying a fly that all of you should know. We're going to tie the partridge in orange. Classic pattern, uses two materials, and still catches fish today. And we're going to get started with this right now. So in the vise today, I have a TMC 300BL, which is a cool hook. It's a barbless check nymph hook. So it's kind of a it's kind of a modern update on. Uh, this classic pattern. Um, I really like their these hooks. They're sticky sharp and they really hold fish. So because this is only two materials, just thread and partridge, I'm gonna create my body with the thread, which is kind of a hot neon orange here. Um, I'm gonna wrap my body to just beyond this hook point, so slightly down the curve. Um, this is something you can adjust. This is just where I like it. So I'm gonna return my thread up keeping it nice and even and making nice touching turns. Um, one thing you want to be careful of is that you don't hit that really sharp point with your thread and break it off. Okay. So right here um, you have a couple options. You can either create a little thread bump for your hackle to pulse against or you can do what I, I'm going to do and just grab a little tiny bit of dubbing and create a little spot here. Uh, I think one of the most or the reason that these flies and soft hackles in general are so effective is that when the hackle comes back and lays down over the hook it traps air under it and it just gives a really realistic appearance. So the partridge feather I picked out today is a classic partridge feather, kind of that grizzly color with a little bit of brown mixed in. Um, I think if you buy a whole partridge skin, you can find some great varying colors, and you can definitely adjust that and figure out what you like for a look. So I've just created a little delta here for my tie-in point. I'm just going to tie that right behind the eye, a couple of wraps. And then I'm going to make I think about two turns around here and just keep it sparse so and as I'm doing this just stroke the fibers back just get them to lay exactly where you want them all right so right there so I'm going to tie this off and create a little head just adjust make sure everything's where I want it to be gonna pull this off and wrap it just a little bit around just so I get a better distribution here hold on okay so just gonna tie that down again check to make sure everything's where I want it to be which it looks like it is I'm gonna cut this off and whip finish So guys, you can find all the materials listed below in the description. And we have all of the material, materials available at tridentflyfishing.com. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Hit the bell button so that you're notified of all of our future videos. Just add a little bit of head cement here and finish this fly off. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.